Hello everyone and in today's tutorial I will show you how you can make use of the sticky video widget which is a premium widget. This is a feature a lot of sites use to display videos on their sites. So on your WordPress site, drag and drop the sticky video widget onto your WordPress site. From the video type drop down list, you will be able to insert links of videos from YouTube and from Vimeo. You can also upload a video from your desktop and also create a link for this very particular video. Just be sure to enable the remote URL button and set your URL address. Under video options, enabling the autoplay option will automatically start playing the video as soon as a user visits your site. Enabling the mute option will play a video silently without any volume, whereas enabling the loop option will replay a video as soon as it reaches its end. The start and end times let you control the portion of the video you only want it to display. You need to disable the loop option for this to work. So if I set the start time to 5 seconds and the end time to 15 seconds, then out of the whole video, the video will only play the portion of the vi video that starts from 5 to 15 seconds. The aspect ratio controls the size of the video that you are displaying. For this tutorial, I will set the option to null. You can also choose not to show the control bar of your video, just disable it to implement this option. If you enable the overlay option, you get to choose a feature image for your video. You can also change the player icon. Click on the icon library button to choose from a whole list of icons. The sticky settings display videos in a corner of a page while a user is scrolling down. So you can position the video to be in the bottom left, top right, bottom right, and so on. It's really up to you how you want to position the videos. If you head over to sticky box under the style section, you will be able to customize the width of your video. And if you're obsessed with the details, you can also change the color of the close button. Under player, you can adjust the width, the height, or add a border to the video. And there's more, you can change the size of the play button and even add some color to the button if you want to tempt users to click on the play button. You can also adjust the position of the bar by customizing the padding and the margin. The basic settings of the sticky video widget ends here, but if you want more control, you can check out the advanced section where you can add other features such as animation or motion effects. If you're in a hurry and just don't have time to customize everything, head over to the widget section of the Happy Add-ons website, scroll down and look for the sticky video widget and click on it. You will see a whole collection of designed sticky videos. If you like one design, click on live copy and then head back to your WordPress site, then right click to select live paste so your ready to use sticky video will be displayed. As always, you can always customize this to your liking. And that is how you can make use of the sticky video widget using the Happy Add-ons plugin. Subscribe to our channel or check the link in the description box below to receive email updates on new web design features using the Happy Add-ons plugin.